was the Jesus Christ he made up in his mind. Which Jesus Christ is it? I lied, really? His, his album, he doesn't even mention the name of Jesus Christ. He's ashamed to name the name of Christ. That's the prey. And that's who we that's who we, we go out and see tonight. The gospel according to Lecrae does not save people. It's the gospel according to Jesus Christ and Nazareth. That's the gospel that saves men's souls. Does Lecrae preach repentance? Does he preach that you have to have a broken, sorrowful heart before God? To go home? Excuse me, ma'am? I'm a Christian. I'm preaching the gospel. I preach the gospel. I have my free speech, and not even including that, I have an anointing from God to preach the gospel, ma'am. So Lord, rebuke you, you wicked devil. Lord, rebuke you, you wicked devil. Lord, rebuke that demon spirit in her. Lord, rebuke that Jezebel spirit. Lord, rebuke that spirit of Jezebel. Lord, rebuke that. See, they hate the gospel. They hate the preaching of the gospel. They want the gospel according to Lecrae. They don't want the gospel according to Jesus Christ. The word of God offends. The Word of God offends people. It offends people. It offends Lecrae because he's ashamed to even talk about it. Why is he going on worldly programs like BET and MTV? What fellowship do we have with the world? That's right. Amen. What fellowship do we have with the world, brothers and sisters? Hallelujah. We've been called out of darkness into his marvelous light. What he's operating on is not. And I know you, I, that's what I'm saying. Let me give you something, okay? I'm going to give you something for you to check out. I just be careful. Well, at least, Man of God. At least that traffic, all of the I'm going to give you something. Oh, I actually, I actually have those in there, too. I got, the I, Reinhardt you know, Bunky Tracks. I know it was the Lord now because I, I, I actually went to search. He's going to give him one about the Reinhardt Bunky Convention, the false See, I, spirit. I have a feeling about that. In any him. case, I, oh, yeah. when I was praying I for you, I did feel like you're called to missions that you. Hallelujah. The, the Word of God yeah. says, I've been the Word of God too. says, if you were of the world, <laughs> I was in Africa for a year. Or if the world yeah. hate you, you know that it hated me before it hated you. Somebody's if you were of the world, the world would love his own, but because ye are not of the world, but I have chosen you out of the world, therefore the world hated you. Remember the word that I said unto you, the servant of my wife, and his Lord. If they have persecuted me, they will also persecute you. If they have kept my saying, they will keep yours also. What persecution is Lecrae getting from the world? The world actually loves Lecrae. BT and MTV and X Double XL magazine, they love Lecrae. He's not being hated or persecuted by the world, no. Andy Mineo's not being persecuted by the world. Mineo, Mineo, whatever. He actually said he wants to make music with Kanye West. A known blasphemer. A known blasphemer. It would be good. Lord, rebuke that. You need to be separate and come out from the world, young lady. The Word of God says, be not unequally yoked with unbelievers. Be not unequally yoked with unbelievers. Come out from amongst them and be ye separate, and touch not the unclean thing. And I will receive you, saith the Lord. That's what the Word of God says. And they mock. They mock the preaching because they have idols built up in their heart. They love their Lecrae. They love their Andy Minio. They love their Greg Laurie show. They don't care about salvation. They don't care about repentance. That's false Christianity right there. Those are false converts right there. You guys are false converts. You guys aren't saved. You look just like the world. Amen. I'm sorry. No, that judge righteous judgment. The word of God says judge righteous judgment. You judge a tree by its fruit. No, no, no. He gives us the judge. He, he, he gives us the spirit of discerning spirits. That's a false spirit. This movement is a false spirit. If the, if the root is bad, the fruit is bad. You judge a tree. No, no. The Toronto blessing. God is angry, actually. God is angry. God hates the wicked. He hates the evil. False gospel. And see, and that's the thing. It's a, so, it's a false, effeminate gospel. And it, it offends people. The word of God offends people with, the, with their easy, easy believism. Say a little, repeat, repeat this little prayer after me and you're saved. No. That's not how you get saved. 
Did you go before the Lord with a broken and contrite heart and spirit? And did you cry out to the Lord, Lord, save me. Forgive me, Lord. I'm a wicked sinner and I'm in desperate need of help. That's right. Did you go before the Lord like that? Or did you go before the Lord in your pride? And are you glory in your pride and in shame? Exactly. And this is what this is what Lecrae produces. It's just a bunch of hippity hoppity. Look at me, I'm cool. It's got nothing to do with the gospel. It's all about the base. I mean, what does it say in the scripture? I've listened to his music. I used to actually listen to that ungodly music. And it did not draw me to God. His music does not draw you to the Lord. It actually reminded me of the world. It reminded me of worldly music. It reminded me of being in the club again. Exactly. Amen. And see, I was once in the world, but guess what? God took me, and He took my broken heart, and all those broken pieces, and He He, he got the dross out. He sifted it out. He removed it. And He took all those broken pieces, and He put it together. God put it together. Not Lecrae. Not Greg Laurie. Not Andy Minio. You can mock the preaching all you want. You're not going to mock Jesus Christ to His face on Judgment Day, young man. Remember that. You're not going to mock Christ. Mockers will not inherit the kingdom of God. They are humble. Amen, sister. God will not be mocked. So you can mock me all you want, young man, with your false faith in the and there goes the Lecrae worshipers. There goes the Lecrae worshipers. They worship him. Father, forgive them for they know not what they do. They, they hate true biblical preaching. They hate the preaching of the cross. They hate to be told they have to actually repent from their sin. Nobody wants to repent. They want to be equally yoked. They want to be equally yoked to the world. They want to be yoked to the world. Why? It's because they were never saved. That's why. There was never any true, genuine conversion in their heart. That's why. They didn't go before the Lord with a broken heart. No. No, they did not. If they had a broken heart before the Lord, they would actually want to hear the preaching. They got their little Lecrae show and now they're leaving. Now they're leaving. They didn't come for Greg Laurie. They didn't come to hear a gospel. No, they came to get entertained. They came to have their ears tickled. They came for the fleshly desires. They got their little easy believism. They got their little dose of spirituality for the night. Now they can go back home and fornicate. They can go back and send their naked pictures on Snapchat. They can do all that wicked stuff. Yeah, because God loves you. The main thing is God loves you too much to send you to hell. You hear that one? I like Acts. Isn't it Acts 2 where Peter preached it and the 3,000 get saved? And they uses the, uh, uh, the uh, expression, they were cut to the heart. Mm. I mean, that's, you know, Amen. cut to the heart. Amen. And we have to be yeah, pricked in the heart. And it says here, I'm going to read the scripture my sister what said, praise God. Acts 2.36 to 40. Therefore, let all the house of Israel know assuredly that God hath made that same Jesus whom ye have crucified, both Lord and Christ. So all those who say, oh, Lordship, salvation, no, you have to make him your Lord. He is Lord. You know, you can't just make, he is Lord of your life. And it wasn't Not Belial. Belial is not Lord of your life. Now, when they heard this, they were pricked in their heart and said unto Peter and to the rest of the apostles, Men and brethren, what shall we do? Then Peter said unto them, Repent and be baptized, every one of you in the name of Jesus Christ, for the remission of sins, and ye shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. See, there, there, there are some prerequisites to receive the Holy Ghost. You have to repent for the remission of your sins. If there's no repentance, there's no Holy Ghost. If you did not go before the Lord with a broken heart, you have not had the Holy Ghost in your life. You have had a fake, false, demonic spirit. And he goes on and says, now mind you, this is a gift. This is a gift. You can't earn it. You can't earn the gift of the Holy Spirit. Just like we can't earn salvation. 
For the promise is unto you, and to your children, and to all that are afar off, even as many as the Lord our God shall call. And with many other words did he testify and exhort, saying, Save yourselves from this untoward generation. Very careful. They were pricked but in their heart from the preaching. He was under the spirit. Pricked in their heart. Operating in different operating the operating. And well, see, that's the thing. We have to be book, pricked in our heart. There has to be a pricking going on in our heart. We have to have our com our conscience convicted. If there's no conviction from your sin, you do not have the Holy Ghost. You have a false, fake, demonic spirit. And you need to repent and get right before the Lord. You have to repent. You have to repent. I'm going to read it again. Therefore, let all the house of Israel know assuredly that God hath made that same Jesus whom ye have crucified, both Lord and Christ. Now when they heard this, they were pricked in their heart and said unto Peter and to the rest of the apostles, men and brethren, what shall we do? Then Peter said unto them, Repent, and be baptized, every one of you, in the name of Jesus Christ, for the remission of your sins. And you shall receive. I'm sorry? We believe how you believe. Then why would you go there with Lecrae then? Lecrae doesn't believe how we believe. Do you like Lecrae? Did Lecrae actually preach the gospel? He did? He, pre he preached repentance? He preached repentance? Then why is he still getting tattoos? Why is he still getting tattoos? Do you not know that our body is the <laughs> temple of God? And you're defiling your temple by getting tattoos, by getting piercings? Oh, I'm sorry, man. Yo, you just tell me, man. Yeah, right. And see, and this is the thing. They defend their idols. They, they say they like the word of God. And then once you actually rebuke their idols, they mock. Brothers, churn, churn from Lecrae. He cannot save you. He does not preach the gospel of Jesus Christ. And see, they just mock. They don't want to hear it. Yes. They think they got it all figured out in their pride. They think they're all cool and all hippity hoppity. And they're going to go cruising. What is? I got it pull up on YouTube. I've never heard of it. Lecrae. It's it's worldly. Sometimes. I mean, what does he talk about? Strong rebuke. Oh, uh, it's. I mean, most of the world talks about love and he, loving he, a woman. I, in a couple God. songs, he sprinkles in God, and he might say Lord. He uh -huh. never says anymore Jesus but Christ. Oh, wow. But in his newest album, it's like all he's talking about is haters and how they're claiming he sold his soul. It's because you did. They're not called haters. These are people reproving you. Yeah. yeah. They're rebuking you. All right, man. And you do not accept the truth. God bless you, sir. God bless, sir. They don't accept reproof. See, this is, we're living in an pray? unreprovable generation. Yeah. Totally unreprovable. He is a believer in the Toronto movement. Oh, I know so that he's praying for him. He was trying to, Lord, use him in signs and what He was trying to do what Bethel Church does. And I felt something around my head. And I started, with, I said, nope, I'll rebuke you in Jesus' name. And then that's when I immediately went into a conversation. What do you think is the Holy Spirit? And that's how it got revealed that he was into the Toronto. You know, he, he thinks Reinhard Bonnke's a man of God. Mm -hmm. Lenny Hinn's a man of God. Rodney Howard Brown's a man of God. That's why he said that, that touch, your, touch not thine anointed. He kind of said that. Little. Yeah. So he was trying to pray like Bethel Church prays, where they go out. I was like, I don't want that anointing. No, no, no. I don't want that anointing. In the name of Jesus, I rebuke it. Matter of fact, Lord, in the name of Jesus, I Amen. rebuke that. Amen. Amen. We rebuke that. I rebuke that spirit. We bind that spirit up, Lord, know, Father God. Lord, I know that he was being genuine. I sense a genuineness. I pray, Father, that you would use those tracks. I thank you, Lord, for reminding me to grab that track today. Amen. That you would use it, Father, because this Amen. man loves the Lord. And he's, he's just deceived, Father. Yes. He's a gentle spirit. He loves you, Lord. Yes. Deliver him, Father, I yes. pray. Deliver him out of the bondage of this false Holy Spirit, Lord, I know what it's like to be entangled in it. Lord, I pray for him, Father, Jesus, and I Lord. renounce and I rebuke that prayer he yes. prayed over me unknowingly. I rebuke that spirit. I don't want any part of that spirit on me, Lord. In Jesus' name, thank you. Amen. Amen. I think he, he's going he's gonna to check out that track. Good. That's the track I got. Dude, that thing is loaded. Amen, it is. Loaded he looks at with it. Bonke, Bethel Church. Oh, I that. want it. I want one of those. Oh, you want one? Yeah. Yeah, I made them for the Bonke conference. Oops, sorry. 
Is that scripture? Well, you got my email. That's okay. Whatever. Maybe that was a God. Yeah. Beware, Satan. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Look at the back. It's loaded with QR codes oh. on that. Oh, okay. And then that one, too. Oh, wonderful. I'll plenty, read it tonight. I'll read it. Plenty oh. of info. Uh, YouTube videos, uh, web links, Dr. Scott Johnson, yes. he's, he's on there. Oh, yeah, he's good. Yeah. So did, he, I, did you get that uh, latest email yeah. from him? He sent me and you that that one where that woman from Germany, yeah, that yeah, one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was yeah. incredible, huh? Wow. Oh, man, Satan is also a fisher, man. Oh, did I write that on there? Yeah. Hallelujah. Keep preaching the word, tonight. And the word of God tonight. And the word of God says, <laughs> I, I don't even you remember word writing word that. God yeah. And the Lord Jesus That's Christ. True. Yeah. You, shall judge you know, I might keep these out at his appearing, just in case. At his kingdom. There might be more people like Preach that the word. Be instant in season, out of season. Reprove, rebuke. You see those exhort girls with all long suffering oh. and doctrine. Really? Yeah. They they the time will come right oh, when they shall. Well, they will not endure well, sound doctrine. But spirits, after their own know. lust, yeah. shall they heed to themselves, it teachers, does. having itching ears. You want me to turn this? Oh, you got it on? And they shall turn away their ears from the truth and shall be turned up to fail. How are you doing? doing? Hi. God bless you. God bless, God bless you. you. You guys leaving for like the LaCrae show? Oh, yeah, we, we were there. Can, can we give you just a little bit of information on LaCrae? Oh, sure. Well, um, do you have, uh, you have an internet smartphone? Yeah, I do. If you look up Brother uh, Neftali 1981. Yeah. Okay, I'll look it up. Um, he's, uh, he's, look him up and then put in LaCrae. He's actually... Um, and in a nutshell, he's a, he's a brother of Christ, but he's um, basically, in a nutshell, exposed how Lecrae's kind of disassociating himself with true Christianity, where now he's afraid. And I, I listened to, actually, today I listened to his Church Flow, his Volume 3 album, and he does not even name the name of Jesus Christ in the songs at all. I'm on listening. He's signed with the I'm on listening to it. Neftali, 1981. That's that Illuminati, worldly. Stuff. They believe in the Illuminati. You know, they they pray to the devil on those on those. Amen. Yeah, they do. And he's, he's a part of that. You know, you got to remember that. You have a pen. Does anybody have a pen? Here, 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 here. I have a pen. No, I don't. Do you have anything I can write on? Yeah, this is and the the brother Neftali. He gives loving exposures. He's not like. Hate, super hate, judgmental, hate filled. He loves believers just like. Because you know what the problem is. A lot of believers, it's not working. I got, I got something better than here. A lot of believers are. Not no, it's not. Are, it's are not. straying away from the real word of God, yeah, and they're, they're, they're compromising. Yeah, they're compromising. And they're like ordered, said, it's ordered. It's a watered down gospel. Yeah. Oh, I know it is. I know it is. And you know what? My husband and I, we talk about it all the time. Where yeah. is the real Christian? Yeah. You know what I mean? Like where? The different churches, the mega churches, where it's all about money. Yeah. You know what? All the time. This was all the plan of the devil from the beginning because the real church okay. back in the first century were being persecuted and hunted down and they were killed in horrible ways. Fox's Book of Martyrs tells us, okay? And then Constantine, <laughs> the Roman Christian. Empire was yeah, falling yeah. apart. Uh -huh. Constantine's the one that started this and amalgamated Christianity. Yep. It's a Roman, that's what a Roman Catholic is. Exactly. That's yeah. what I came I studied that. Yeah, a little bit. Actually, I studied that. <laughs> yeah, when I was in college, in art, in art history, yeah. <laughs> and studied all the way back then, and that's how I learned about that. But It's a shame that you be conformed like that. Yeah, and Constantine claimed yeah. to be a born-again yeah. Christian, yeah. but he was a bail worshiper. Oh, I know. I know. We yeah. know about Rome had many gods. Yeah, I know they did. I know they did. They worship many gods. Yeah. Everything, everything under the sun was a god. Right. Was god. And, and what they did is they adopted the Greek god. Yeah. Yeah. So they didn't do it. They didn't. You know, yeah, all they did was rename yeah, well, he just, he said tonight, like, the Greek god. Oh, wow. yeah. That's all they did. Yeah. Yeah. They took it and they renamed it. Yeah, wow. they had a whole bunch of gods. Oh, I know. Oh, I know. I know. I know about it. Yeah. But you know, it, it's sad. And we've had the cops out here for you. We don't have the Christians that really love the Lord. <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh, yeah, it is. Like I said, with the different mega churches. Actually, this brother, uh, he, brought, he brought his daughter 
So like I said, the first one the first time were, Justin, Bieber, Bieber, Justin Bieber and he actually Rose, seen the prey. Yeah, I did. Justin Bieber found it. I rebuked him too. <laughs> things, he just did right? it. And yeah, he just kind of did a peace sign. He did. He wanted yep. to get yeah, rid of the Christians. Yep. Because the Christians I said, I said, I see you. Because the Romans were right. Yeah, no. They they prayed to and not, you know. And so the Christians were saying no. It wasn't in those exact words. One God. And so they wanted to stop them out. Nothing was working. So Constantine comes along. So I know he heard it. Yeah. The, yeah. But, you know, we're praying for the brother. Right. 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 I mean, everybody. I mean, I'm not everybody against the brother. You know, the pagans had their beautiful temples. He's destroyed them. No, no. Even in a video, he gives an interview with Exodus Magazine. So we're going to have these beautiful buildings. Look, before they're hiding in caves and holes. And now we're going to have all these nice things. Then he took the so-called He's like, I might be a Christian. Ministers. But and he gave them salaries, and he made them tax exams. But Does this have All of a sudden, they have Amazon, good life. Mm -hmm. as and that's when they completely... Oh, 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 so you're saying, it I know. Yeah. And you it's sad. It's sad. Because you know what? Back when I was growing up, back when I was growing up, I remember going to church, and the church was there. Yeah, album I listened to, he's, I mean, I used to, I used to, he's more than I that one, but um, uh, he's got a song E-40. My grandmother was back. I used to listen to E-40, so I didn't know what kind of, yeah. And they were there for you. But you know, so that's you know, agree. You, know, you don't have to agree. I can love you in Christ, but I don't have to agree with what you're doing. Oh, okay, yeah. And that's what that's when the Lord exposed it to me. Sorry. Everybody at the Bobby Jones. Thank you. All they wanted was a record deal. Right. And my heart I love you. wanted to worship God. You pray. And I was like, I don't want to do yeah. this. Love and the Lord dealt with me about the story That's right. of hip-hop. God says that. Which a lot of God the Christian rappers, they end up worshiping yeah. the spirit of hip-hop. So it becomes more so about hip-hop. You, you got to love. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you know? God loves and, so, and discipline. You know, when he chastises us, he chastises us in love. But he lets us know when you're wrong. When you're wrong, you're wrong. I mean, you're wrong. It's all about it's all hip-hop. It's all, you know, positivity, black power, and stuff. Yeah, that's right. I agree with that totally. Yeah. Yeah, My, our kids, got no, out of it. Yeah. we don't you know, play that. Right. You're going to respect right. your mother and father yeah. Yeah. so you can have a long life because that's what the yeah. word of God says. Right. 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 He's got the perfect plan. The devil got his marriage. God put him there. What happens is when the money starts Same sex marriages and things like that. Oh, no, you're not supposed to do it. That's one thing about our children, which is a blessing. I haven't they made it myself, my last one. That yeah. so we go through try. trials and tribulations in our marriage. But they know we were, uh, mommy and daddy we were are still together Kirk Franklin as one in Christ. Too. Kirk, Kirk Franklin is crazy. So that yeah. they we know that they get married, we don't run out when it gets hard. Yeah. Before you've been in I got, you know I what I mean? You don't you don't, don't go running you, somewhere else. You you yeah, pull yeah. closer to God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kirk Franklin, he's yeah. yeah. been performed the same thing. Oh, yeah, you know, look at the mindset. You know, I want to say that thing. And seeing that's the shame thing of it. You know, Christians are like, so I can I can have my Kirk and my Kanye. Yeah, yeah. You know, I can have my Libra and my new song with you. New song. Oh yeah. Yeah, and that's not Tali Hill. If you guys watch some videos, he'll tell our kids all the time. They're smart. Brian Moonen, look him up. Satan, when he was in heaven, he was really being taken over. He was the leader yeah, of worship. So if he was the leader of worship, um, don't you think he's going to get into the music and to start the, the leader of Hillsong, mm -hmm. what's his name? Brian. And Brian Houston. And I see, I didn't know about Lecrae. back in his right. past, he started getting he off of the prosperity gospel. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Nobody knows that. And he'll use that for the flesh. Yeah. And yeah. he yeah. works yeah. through the emotions. You know, he gets people. Yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah, And then the other thing we can do, you know, in our mindset, we just enjoy all that. Yeah, all that. All that. He started getting into that. Sure. Hillsong. With you and me. Oh, yeah. well, I know. The church is going to be with you. We would meet in a building, a meeting place. But now it's like, let's go to the church. Well, I never really thought. I mean, I like the church. The church is within us. Let me ask you a question. How do you feel about Tyler? 
it's, it's that's kind of why we, we come out it's to Christian not. events as well. We don't just go <laughs> Someone away. I agree. I heard that. See, like I, believe, it's it's tithing. Tithing. I believe tithing, I believe tithing shouldn't go to a building. If you tithe, it's supposed to be helping someone. That's right. And oh, I don't, yeah. I don't well, give no church five times. New tithe, Testament tithe. is 100%. I give, I, I, that's Old Testament law. Yeah, yeah, I give, and, and God, God says that He didn't. Christ said He, he didn't joyful, come. He didn't come to change about, about what was already now, written. That's fulfill right. It. He came to I fulfill it. That's right. So the Old Testament still right. stands. Look what these churches what do. Happened? They get a building, and they get bigger and bigger, and they all want to make a major church. Right. And now you've got to give them money because they need, you know, they need to repair or they need to build a building fund. It's always a building fund. There's always a building fund. Be safe. We'll look it up and keep preaching the, the true word Amen. of God. Amen. God because my husband and I, we have a Christian ministry as well, Amen. and we sing. And it was it was a calling on my life that you know what? When God, see that's the difference. When God calls You're like you something, video, yeah. When God calls you into something, it's never something you ask for. Mm -hmm. I don't think no. it's oh, always me, something that you're running from, that's right. or something that is like God. I'm like, you want me to do this? And that's how it is with you have our music. Flesh. You die in the yeah. Flesh. You know, with our music, it's the same thing. You know, mm -hmm. he called me into it, and I think for the Lord, you know, my husband talks about all the time. You have these different artists. They say, "I'm not going to show up unless you pay me twenty thousand wow. dollars." I said, "That's ridiculous. That's right. You're supposed to show up because you want to get people saved." Yeah. Me, uh, let me give you Keith my Green card. Started not charging um, for his records. Uh, he, when he was a my wife. Who? Green. No, he never charged. Yeah, he, he, um, when, when he was under his record deal, deal, and they broke it. Are. So um, we'll start maybe get in contact yeah. with those. I will. Maybe. Uh, is this your daughter? Oh, that's his daughter. Actually. That's your daughter. She's yeah. so pretty. Hi, yeah, sweetie. Yeah, I got three daughters. I got twins in home too, and my wife. So. That is so awesome. <laughs> yeah. I, you know, I, I, I asked her because you know what? I'm a, I come from an interracial family. Yeah. My mother, my mother is uh, Polish and Spanish. Oh, okay. And my and my father is African American. Yeah. My grandmother is you know, Polish, full Polish. Right. And my aunt and uncle. Um, are from my grandmother's. Unfortunately, it didn't work out with her first marriage, but she had a second marriage, and they're from, and they're 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 all Polish. And we grew up. My kids grew up in family where we see all different colors yeah. in my family because see, that's the true kingdom of God. Mm -hmm. It's oh, yeah. not about one color or no. one race. It's about who we are well, inside yeah, here. Revelation testifies three times. Yeah, all nations, all mm -hmm. tribes, and all tongues really represented. Yes. Yes. Oh, yeah. in fact, I hate it. I'll go even I deeper. Hate it. I'll go even deeper. When it you hurts. become born into the kingdom, you're no longer white. white you're not, you don't have no color. You don't, you, you're, you you're are a new, child of God. Yeah, that's you, you're a citizen of God. You have a new race, a citizen of a new country. Exactly. Yes, that's all he sees. So the division and you know in the church like oh, that is hurts. all fleshy. It's so it hurts. It hurts. Yes. But I said it because it's beautiful yeah, for, yeah, for children yeah. to see that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. To see that, you know what, there is no color. Yeah, we're, we're very protective over them. About and, and you know what, and that's a beautiful thing. Yeah. Yeah. I grew up loving my family. I didn't see no color in my family. My grandmother. My grandmother was my grandma. Yeah, that's right. My dad was my dad. My yeah. other grandma was my other grandma. And you know what? Care. You want to go further than that? In, in the book of Acts, I, I should get that chapter where he says we all came from one blood. We yeah. all right. came from one yeah. blood. Yeah. We all came from uh, Ken Ham, he says there's only two races. Those that are racing for heaven and those that are Thank racing you. for hell. There you go. And that's the truth. <laughs> I love that. I'm going to start using that one. <laughs> yeah. But you know what? That's a beautiful thing. And it's, it's, it's sad that the enemy, the enemy always finds a way to divide. That's what that's his job is to divide so he can try to kill He uses the media them. to do it. That's oh, right. oh my gosh. The media works that's for right. Satan. Yeah. Works yeah. right for Satan. Well, they work for corporate America. Well, corporate America, all that is part of the like Illuminati that. and all I, that I stuff. I, I, I don't yeah. watch that those Freemason. TV for years. I don't watch TV. Amen. I don't watch that TV out of my house. Cut it out. Because, you know, talk my language spirits, now. there's demonic spirits that come through that <laughs> sure, TV yeah. and jump sure. around. He's the we talk about it all the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We talk about it all the time. Sure. That's right. God bless you. God bless, God bless you. you. And keep preaching God's word. Definitely. Okay. Thank God you. Bless you. you. Oh, God bless you. Yeah, look at uh, Josiah. That's a wonderful name. It is. That's a really good name. King Josiah. Yeah, definitely, God bless right? you. God bless you. God bless you. Right. God bless you. Right. God bless you. Right. I'll be in touch. Okay. okay. Right. Thank bless. you. Bye, sweetheart. Nice meeting you. Nice meeting you. Amen. Praise the Lord. You see, that made it all worth it. Amen. Amen. See, and and there's God, he always sends them out. I'm sorry I went much help to you. Oh, you're good. Yeah, he's he's preaching. I know. I'll get you something. Else. This might almost be one of the events where you almost have to do more one-on-one. -on -one. Yeah, I think so.
It seems like the one on ones yeah. are getting more, yeah. except for the few that were just out of time. For right. Like Timothy. Oh, he's man. influenced by that. Man. Yeah, but but he's so loves God. Spirit, man. I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have agreed. I'm that. That really Oh, I, I love him. Josiah. Yeah, that's cute. I like that one. Sweet. See, I can't, I, we can't do Josiah. Josiah, Joseph. Wait, what you, if it's a boy, what do you name him? Nehemiah. And if it's a girl? Yeah. We still don't know yet. I, I like the name Julia. But like, she was talking about me, uh, Sarah. That's her mom's name. I think it's a boy. Yeah, but she was was she I know. Right? <laughs> is she gonna have the ultrasound? Um, she had one already, uh, and then we're going to the uh, OB GYN. Is this still uh, going? I think so. Uh, the, uh, oh, dude, you're gonna have to edit.